hi guys good morning so i just finished a home workout session i just want to do a little confession time like i haven't been the most consistent at the gym in like two weeks i'm telling you i haven't gone to the gym in like two weeks and every time that i think about going to the gym now i feel so intimidated by the thought of it like oh my god i'm going to go to the gym and then it makes me start feeling very intimidated i don't know why that is but today i just said that you know what i'm going to ease back into it and so i did like some home workout i did mostly just jump ropes so i, I did like skipping i did about 1100 skips i'm telling you i've become so unfit it legit took me 20 minutes to skip 1100 i'm like <laughs> what how can it take me 20 minutes to skip 1100 so i'm still wearing my sports bra actually and i got this sports bra from um thrift room ng where i buy my gym wears um it's just a regular sports bra but yeah anyways i wanted to show you guys something you guys i did a thing and i went ahead to buy a youtube pillow Ta -da! I feel like, would I really be a YouTuber if I didn't have a YouTube pillow? Would I really be a real YouTuber if I didn't have a YouTube pillow? Like everyone and their grandmother has a YouTube pillow. So I was just like, you know what, why not if not? Let me just go and get a YouTube pillow. So I actually bought this YouTube pillow off of Instagram. Then you guys. <laughs> My papa's grass is finally here. Like what? You guys know that I was talking about it. I don't know if you guys remember when my friend um, sent me this flower vase. And now this is the pampas grass. Again, I just got this about two weeks ago. And I actually ordered different sets. As you can see, there are different colors of the pampas grass. There's the pink one, there's the white one, and then there's the normal grass color. This, let me just prefix this by saying that this is actual grass right but it's just like dried decorative grass so it's actually like real grass do you know what i mean when i got it it wasn't it was a bit scrunched up because of how it was packaged right so i just did some research on it and they said that if you wanted it to like fan out properly so that you can get the real beauty all you needed to do was just like air it in the sun and trust me you guys when i did that i just aired it for like a day it also came with a slight smell if i'm being honest but the smell has reduced significantly so this again i saw pampas grass on instagram when my friend told me that she was gonna buy this as my gift for my birthday i saw pampas grass on instagram and child they were selling the pampas grass like one stick for two five i'm like child <laughs> that is not going to be me baby no <laughs> so i just went again and found the these ones are a bit different from the ones that they sell on instagram if i'm even being honest because the ones they sell on instagram are um bigger like this is one stick of one you can see that it's not that long you can see it's not that long the ones on instagram are actually really long so they're like for bigger spaces but I, I mean i didn't need that i just needed something portable enough and this one does the trick so yeah it's actually really pretty and i'm definitely here for it i should just prefix this by saying that this pampas grass sheds a whole freaking lot so if you are not really about that life that might piss you off a little bit so guys oh uh, i've had my natural hair in now I've, like, like i've been carrying my natural hair for about three weeks because i wanted my scalp to you know rest i feel like i've been doing braids back to back and i still want to do braids actually do you understand i still want to make braids but i just wanted my scalp to rest i don't know if i'm the only one who feels like this but i've noticed that anytime that i carry my natural hair even though it's not combed out right now i don't feel sexy do you know i feel cute because it makes me look significantly younger but not i don't feel sexy i don't know if it's something about the way we've been conditioned to think that um, extensions are better than natural hair i don't know but mm, i just know that my natural hair i feel i feel much sexier when i have a weave 
or braids or something than I do my natural hair. I just feel when I have my natural hair. I don't know if that makes sense to you. And by the way, I just wanted to say thank you guys for 5k subscribers. We are at 5k. You guys are amazing. Please share my videos with everyone who cares to watch it. You guys know that I say this all the time and I genuinely mean it because I mean, what is better than growth? I, I mean, I can't really think of anything that is better than growth. So please share my videos so that we can all grow together and yeah. And welcome. I'm not sure if this is the beginning of the vlog, but either ways, good morning. How are you guys doing? You guys would have seen this dress one billion times in my vlogs at this channel because I promise you that this is my go to dress. Like every time I'm at home and I just want to do chores or any of that, this is what I wear. Anyways, I don't know if I told you guys that we resumed work. So yes, I am going back to work and today I am on the night shift. So I kind of have the whole morning to myself and I've just used that to edit a YouTube video that is probably going to have gone up by the time that you're seeing this. It was my husband's birthday and that video was essentially just um, his birthday vlog because I convinced the guy to take pictures for his birthday. It was like a birthday photo shoot type thing because he didn't actually do anything for his birthday, you know, but I wanted us to have a party but he was like nah he doesn't feel like he's at that point that he wants to have a birthday party so i'm like okay fine if you don't want to have a birthday present at least you're going to take pictures and so that vlog was basically just his birthday um photo shoot vlog right anyways you guys i got a new phone for my birthday my my husband bought a new phone for me and that's what i'm currently using to film my video you guys know that i used to use my um samsung galaxy s10 plus that was the phone i used to use before but right now i am using the samsung galaxy s21 ultra that's the phone that my husband got for me for my birthday and apart from that he also got me the um samsung bud life uh this is what it looks like it's just like yeah i don't know if you guys can see that yeah yeah but it's basically like earbuds yeah galaxy bud live basically like the airpods that the apple guys use but because i'm not really an apple fan i'm more of a samsung person so i use um yeah he got me this so right now i have my samsung phone my samsung galaxy active watch 2 which is my favorite smart watch actually it's the only smart watch i've ever used but i absolutely love 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 that smart watch and then i also have this so like i'm a full-blown samsung babe anyways let me just you know what i'm going to go and grab <laughs> i want to grab it and just show you guys i already put it in like a case just so that it doesn't scratch and all of that but this is i'm removing it from the case it's rose gold to match with my watch this is what it looks like and then this is it as well on the inside so it's really nice and i really like it so yeah anyways that is that about that so you guys if you've noticed in my recent videos i haven't been using a microphone to film my recent videos and that's because the way this my current phone is set up right it doesn't have a 3.5 millimeter jack so you can't use a regular um, 3.5 millimeter jack um earpiece microphone nothing you can't use any of that you have to use a type c jack and this is a type c this is what this is what it actually uses so i've tried to find a type c microphone but i haven't really been successful at it and that's why i have been filming the most of my videos without um a microphone i recently ordered a like what's that thing called an adapter yeah so that if i can um I, if I can use my regular mic, I'll just use the adapter on my phone, but it hasn't come yet But if you guys know anywhere that can get a 3.5 millimeter jack 
I said 3.5 a type C USB type C um, microphone you guys please let me know I will definitely love it and yeah that is that about that again now the thing that annoyed me the most about this my new phone is the fact that samsung has decided to start copying apple and they didn't include a phone charger and child let me tell you that that thing pained me because that meant that i had to go and get a phone charger and this thing just this thing Freaking expensive. You guys don't even want to know the price. It cost me 12,000 naira just to buy this thing. And I'm like, after spending so much money buying a new phone, why the hell do I have to spend an extra dime to get this? Like, what the hell? It's so freaking annoying. Because the phone is expensive, and then I'll still spend extra money to buy this. Like, child, no. I don't know who told these people that this was a good idea, but I can promise that it's really not. It's a stupid idea, and they need to fix it, because no. Absolutely freaking really no anyways anyways you guys i feel like i've rambled all through but yeah i just wanted to give you guys a quick update um i i, I think i want to make a day in my life as a doctor vlog uh, i'm going to do that soon enough maybe when i'm on the morning shift or maybe even night shift i don't know but i don't think i want to make that vlog tonight so right now i'm just trying to make breakfast and i am making um roasted potatoes roasted sweet potatoes that's actually what i want to eat today actually it's not breakfast because the time is about 1 p.m <laughs> and i haven't even had my bath so i'll call it more like brunch i haven't had anything to eat today so it's like a breakfast lunch type thing yeah let me just quickly add that even though we resumed work we haven't really been paid our full salary so i envisage that this resumption isn't going to be that long if they don't pay the salary complete but i don't know i'm just i just want my money do you understand i just want my money and if you guys don't know what i'm talking about i worked as a medical doctor in the emergency department and i have i was owed salary for such a long time like from January to about May, I wasn't paid. So that was like five months salary. And then we went on strike in May because, I mean, why should you be working for five months without getting your salary? So when we were on strike, we were on strike from May till June. And then we were paid January, February, March, April. All right. So they paid four months. And right now we, re we resumed in June and they haven't paid May or June salary and we're in July and there's still no hope of collecting July salary so I don't know I just feel like it's like a literally vicious cycle like we just keep going back and forth like it's it's exhausting I kid you not it's actually freaking exhausting you guys tell me why I have this very rude and disrespectful pimple here like I legit want to burst it mm -hmm. but it's so painful I don't know if I should just go ahead to bust it mm. Mm. it's actually really painful i think i'm just gonna leave it alone till it ripens a little more like what's this what's that mm? <laughs> anyways let me go and cook my breakfast stroke lunch my brunch i want to go and cook it and yeah <laughs> I've been on my way up, now it's really far down I don't think I'll feel it when I hit the ground In October it feels like summertime I keep falling for you like every night Hey guys, I just finished filming a video and I'm so excited because I was able to film the video. Uh, yeah, so guys, I wanted to mention that 
I have reopened my business. I don't know if you guys know this, but I run a business on Instagram called Beige Jewelry. Last year, because of the whole COVID thing, it really hit me hard and I wasn't able to, you know, continue the business because of the whole COVID thing. But I am so excited because I have actually reopened the business and it just gives me so much joy to let you guys know that I have reopened my business and you guys can patronize me if you want. Now, Beige Jewelry is a page where I sell customized gift items not just jewelry like the name implies you can get customized watches customized wallets customized jewelry you know personalized for that extra special touch and I just want to show you guys one of my orders that is my bag this is my bag that you know I just put my stuff in like you can see these jewelry I just put my stuff in there and in here I have this customized wallet I'm going to show you guys what it looks like this is the wallet you can see that it has his initials PK and then on the inside you can see some wordings now this wallet is a really really good quality it is genuine leather and it will last you a lifetime like i promise it will last you a lifetime i also have customized cufflinks can you guys see that like i have different designs and you guys can just check out my instagram page so that um you can see everything i, I have i have watches jewelry bracelets cufflinks necklaces you know a lot of things so i'm going to leave my instagram page on the screen and down in the description box so that you guys can check it out and gift your significant other a very special gift now i should say just in case you want to patronize my business the shipping does take quite a bit of time it takes between four to five weeks to get down to nigeria because they are not made locally and um again they're personalized items so it takes quite a bit of time but i have an express line like this one is from my express line and the wallet is from my express line you can also get it regular shipping that is a bit cheaper than if you opt for the express line so it all depends on you really at the end of the day but yeah i can't wait to have your orders i can't wait to receive your orders guys i'm super excited so yeah that's all i wanted to tell you about and yeah i feeling me i look pretty i know <laughs> the next morning so today i have a bunch of things that i want to do first of all i want to go to the tisalat office nine mobile they're no longer at tisalat i changed my phone like i mentioned my husband gave me a phone for my birthday and my former line right that i used to use for whatsapp i'd lost that line like a year ago so that line is actually my real WhatsApp number and I want to retrieve the line. So that's why I'm going to the Edsalat office. I've been on this issue back and forth for like a year now because every time I go to that Edsalat office, that be nine mobile office, they're always telling me they don't have network, they don't have network. Now, it has been over a year. So the last time I went, they told me that they've bought the line, blah, 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 blah. They eventually called me that I can come back now. But then it turns out that the affidavit that I used for my SIM certificates because I've actually lost my sim certificate affidavit that i used for my sim certificate has expired because it's about six it's over six months old already so i have to go and get another <laughs> affidavit that is husband man right there he's following me to the excellent office say hi <laughs> anyways so yeah that is what is up anyways after that after the excel at office then i'm going to make my hair you guys i've been carrying my hair like this for like three weeks or a month already and you know you know i was telling you guys that i don't really feel sexy when my hair is out like this so guess what i'm going to be doing there's this wig that life like, i was wearing in the vlog that in the video that me and her made on this channel and if you haven't seen that video i'm going to link it up in the card so that you can watch it the um dr drinking game video i don't really remember what that video was called but i think it was truth or truth or drink yeah so the wig that she was wearing this is it i actually legit took that wig from her because number one she didn't really like the wig i mean i liked it because i thought it looked nice but she didn't really like it you know she sells hair and she felt like the quality of this wig wasn't that good <laughs> so she didn't want that wig to be in her collection i mean i'm like <laughs> 
it's a pretty hair so i might as well take it do you know what i mean so i took the wig and i'm going to go and install it in the salon because the frontal wig and to be honest i don't want to be like worrying about my hair i want to have this wig off like a week or maybe a little over a week i don't know so yeah that is the second thing i want to do and the third thing is just to stop at the market and buy a few a few stuff so that i can have some food for the week because i'm currently off duty today so i have some time and i want to just stock up the house so that i don't have to worry about food and all of that for like a week because i actually go to the market every week so yeah that is what is up i'll see you guys when i start my errand <laughs> Girlfriend, because, because you are beautiful. Your idea is good too, and I come, I come love you. I love you, my girlfriend, because, because you are beautiful. Your idea is good too, and I come. The tab that is for registration is down and once again i cannot get my sim today this thing is becoming annoying because it has been i've been trying to get this sim for like a year and i'm not i'm not exaggerating for like a year but every single time there's a story that is told same thing that's happened today again at this point i'm just thinking if i should just forget about the whole thing and just move on but i don't know i'm just annoyed essentially Try na kilo de kilo shelle go go. I'm hyping myself because child. Let me just tell you for free. I don't know how to act. Do you know like you guys know when you do your hair? I am feeling so cute. Ask me right now. I feel cute or whatever. <laughs> God, beauty of the beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> I'm hyping myself. Beauty of the beautiful. Urgh. God of mercy. I just that's that's the charger I took out to the salon. It's inside my bag. I just want to use this moment to thank. Okay, um, the lace is showing a little bit, so maybe I'm going to have to put like my shade of foundation on it. But apart from that. Uh, my shade of concealer or foundation, anyone in your mind, you know about hair, Abby. No. Anyways, you guys, you know, I was saying I didn't feel sexy before, <laughs> but my sexy, they worry me now. <laughs> okay, okay, that's it. I'm rambling at this point. <laughs> Bye. One more times one million. <laughs> I attempted to make Akara, that's actually what I'm still trying to do, but child, <laughs> this is not Akara because what the hell is this akara pancakes like look at it's so flat <laughs> what's this <laughs> i'm actually laughing at myself because we're supposed to have this for dinner but i don't know i'm going to eat it with love and affection like i always say this is a cooking fail i actually used um beans flour to do it but i think i didn't use i didn't incorporate enough air into the akara so it makes the account flat so i'll i mean i'll try again next time but 
so far so good this is what our akara is looking like and i've just decided to name it akara akara pancakes because child this is not akara at all we're having pancakes akara beans pancakes let's say it that way 